it just opened up a new little area so I can get a couple more new purses. <laughs> Guess where I'm at? In the closet. Yes, that same damn old closet. Oh my goodness sex. So anyways, um, <laughs> I swear to God, I am getting deliveries every single day. Like I know it's Christmas time and a lot of the deliveries are presents for my grandkids and everything else, but a lot of presents are for me. <laughs> I have been ordering so much for me. I don't know why. I'm just like, yes, new rug here. New this, new this, new this, new this. But, okay, so I wanna, I wanna share this with you guys. How many of you guys, mm -hmm, this is how you kind of showcase your sunglasses, right? Well, you know that's how I show, showcase my sunglasses. Um, just kind of like lay them out and just whatever, right? Well, I got tired of that look. And I was like, God, there's gotta be a better way to display my sunglasses. like. Other than that. Plus, when I have people in the closet, I'm always afraid something's going to get taken or whatever. So, one day I was on Amazon, I think. And I'm looking for Christmas presents and I'm doing this and doing that. And look what I found. Yes! Look at that. I mean, just like, how cool is this? O-M-G. <laughs> I'm like, are you kidding me? Oh my God, where have you been my whole life? This is just like in the department stores or or whatever, right? I was like, how cool is this? And it holds like 24 pairs of sunglasses. Well, guess what? I have like 46 pairs of sunglasses. <laughs> I think that we're, so I, my other one just arrived. So now I have two. And so my goal is to put both of them over in this area so that I can open this up for another purse or two or three or four. <laughs> so I thought, well, how fun is this? I'm going to sit here and fill up my new one with sunglasses. So um, I'm going to actually take this one, which is full. How cool is this, right? And look, they even lock. So I'm going to try to make sure we put the link in the description box below so that you guys can order these if you want. I mean, like, so amazing. So, I got the other one right here. So cool. I'm so excited, guys. I mean, like, I'm so excited. So excited. So, basically, now I'm going to have my sunglasses on display, and I'll just put the boxes away. So, I, there's not going to be any reason for all this clutter. You know, I'm all about making sure everything is displayed nicely. You can see everything. Remember my motto, if I can't see it, I'm not gonna wear it. And so I like to make sure that everything is on display so I can see it. I don't wanna have to dig through boxes and dig through that and dig through this to try to find something. I want it readily available. So there's not gonna be any rhyme or reason on how I put them in here. Um, these are products. I haven't seen these for a long time. See, <laughs> they're probably stuffed back in the corner or something and I wasn't able to see them. So, um, yeah, so this is going to be fun. I cannot wait. And you're like, well, why do you need so many pairs of sunglasses? You probably don't even wear all these. Yeah, I do guys. I mean like, you know, whether you're doing a photo shoot or oh, look at these cool Dior's. Oh my God. Um, whether you're doing a photo shoot or whether you're just Picking out a great outfit to wear. I always like to pick different, ooh, look at these Tom Fords. Ooh, ooh, these are hot. Look at these. Yes, 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 yes. So like I said, whether you're uh, just picking out a great outfit to go somewhere or whether you're doing a photo shoot, um, <clears throat> whatever. I mean, I love, love, love to, oh, these are another pair of cool Dior's. Look at those. Mm, these are hot. Ooh, yes, mama. Mm, love, 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 love. So anyways, um, like today is December 12th, I believe. Um, something like that. Look, we're, I mean, like Christmas is knocking on the door, guys. Knocking on the door. I hope 
hope all of you have gotten your Christmas shopping done. So, um, God, Ooh, look at these Mimi's. Mm-hmm. I haven't worn these for a while. I need to dig these out. These are really cool. Um, but like I said, whether we're doing a photo shoot and we need a different pair of sunglasses to go with the outfit to make everything complete or whatever, um, I, I just don't think you can ever have too many pairs of sunglasses. Look at these Pradas. Oh my God. I remember I bought these running through an airport one time. These are great Pradas. And for some reason I was running through the airport and all of a sudden I looked over and I saw these really cool sunglasses and I said, hey, need those, need those. So uh, hopefully you've all gotten your Christmas shopping done and you're actually taking this next 10 days or whatever to relax. I don't think many of us are doing any Christmas parties. Although, you know what? I was in the hair salon the other day um, getting my hair done and I asked the girl that was blowing out my hair, I said, hey, have you heard of people having any Christmas parties this year? You know, I'm, I'm sure nobody's having office parties or Christmas parties. And she said, you wouldn't believe it, but yes, we've got a lot of people that are having Christmas parties. People are coming in here to get their hair blown out all the time. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Wouldn't those be called, wouldn't those be considered super spreaders? <laughs> okay. I have literally gotten every pair out. Okay, boxes. So you can see, so I must have, so that's 24, 24, and I'm only missing one, two, three, four. So I have 44 pairs of sunglasses. <laughs> so anyways, and then I can lock it. How cool is this? Yes! So, let's see what it looks like. Let's, let's wave that magic wand and see how it looks with both of them sitting in here. So what do you think? Pretty damn cool. I am just in love. Look at that. Oh my God. Like, yes. So much cleaner, sleeker, more organized. You know, I'm, all, I'm a freak about organization, but oh my God, that just looks so amazing. Like, look at that guys. It takes up way less space. Like I said, we're gonna put the link uh, to these on uh, from Amazon uh, in the description box below. But I am just so, I'm like, what took me so long? <laughs> what took me so long? Like, where, how come I didn't think of this earlier? Uh, oh God, I'm just, uh, so anyways, <clears throat> it just opened up a new little area so I can get a couple more new purses. <laughs> I don't know if you saw uh, up there the latest Dior's um, that I've been getting, but yeah, just I've been been doing a little bit of shopping for myself. Look at this, I couldn't, I could not resist. I saw it on a little website. I think it actually came from the website where I get my ego, my ego boots or whatever they're called. Just a cute little clutch, cheap little thing. I don't know, I was like forty nine dollars, uh, fifty nine, maybe it's ninety nine dollars. I don't know, but I thought how cute it just. It reminded me of a Judith Lieber, but it's not a Judith Lieber. But yeah, even even myself, I get inexpensive little purses every once in a while. Doesn't matter. But it's really late, late, late on Saturday night. I look like hell. I've been up since the crack of dawn doing all kinds of work. Um, but anyways, I want to sit down for a minute and talk to you about motivation. So guys, I just wanted to get in here and give you a little motivational speech or a little inspiration or something like that. Um, you know, this past week, uh, Lamar's stepdaddy, who's my father-in-law, um, contacted us and wanted us to come to Lafayette and see him. He's 95. And at first I was gonna say no, because I thought, oh my God, he's 95. You know, don't go around older people, because you just, you know. And he said, Teresa, I'm 95 years old. Oh, my little buddies are coming in to see me. Buddies are coming in to see me. They can't see you guys. Yes, they're my little buddies. Buddies, yeah, they're my little buddies. Yes, they want to help me film. <laughs> they're getting so big, guys. Oh my god, they're such little lovers. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, mom's got to film. Mom's got to film. So, anyways, um, he said, Teresa, I'm 95. He said, I want to see you guys. He said, 
What if I'm not here next month? What if I'm not here six months from now? What if I'm not here next year? You know, he says, I want to see you guys. He says, if you guys are safe, he says, we're safe. And I just want to see you guys. And so we drove to Lafayette, Louisiana. And um, this is Ricky. This is my little brother. This is <laughs> Ricky Roo. And that's little loudmouth Nicky Nay. Yes, sir. Um, so we drove to Lafayette. About a four-hour drive. We had lunch with them. Um, you know, she's got ten kids, and he's got Lamar and brother. And anyways, they're... guys, I'm trying to film. <laughs> but anyways, um, they wanted to see us. We wanted to see them. We took all precautions. Wore masks. You know, we did eat together. But you know. This whole world is just so freaked out with the coronavirus and everything. And, you know, we, we really thought long and hard about it. And he said, I want to see you guys. If you, if you think you're sick, you know, don't come. But if you're, if you're not sick and if you're feeling fine, you know, I, I want to see you guys. So I, I was so pleased and happy that we went. Because um, when someone's 95, you never know. And he's in perfect health. Like, like. He still drives, he still has a driver's license, he still goes to the office every day. The man's in perfect health at 95, it just amazes me. Um, so, yeah, so, uh, yeah, so I, I think the word here, guys, the motivation I'm trying to say is, you know, we, as, as much as we need to be careful, we also have to live our lives. And um, that's what my husband and I do every single day is we just... We're careful, um, we avoid things, we avoid people, we do things, so on and so forth, but you know, you just have to be careful. I had a girlfriend the other day, um, she lost a daughter a few years ago to suicide, um, and then she just lost her son the other day, 19, 19 years old. Good God, guys, I'm trying to do a big help. Anyways, life is short, guys, life is precious, and if there's things you wanna do, and just, God, you know, if you want to go get the vaccine, go get the vaccine. I'm not getting the vaccine. I think it's too early. It's too soon. Um, I want to see it out for a while to see the adverse reactions and and whatnot. Um, but anyways, guys, it's been a, a so far. It's been a great holiday season. Um, we've been doing a lot of filming. We've been doing a lot of shopping. Um, so it just oh gosh, I'm just. I'm just so tired of this COVID. I know you guys are too, and we're trying our best to all of us abide by what they want us to do. Um, but it, it gets tiring and taxing after a while. I know there's a lot of places that are shut down and locked down. Um, thank God Texas isn't one of them, and we're allowed to move about freely and whatnot. But, you know, we're doing it safely, and we're doing it discreetly, and, and just... You know, but I won't be doing any Christmas parties. We're not having the, we're not having the influencer party. We're not having any Christmas parties or anything. So, with that said, we need to announce the winner of the big makeup box giveaway, the the surprise makeup box giveaway. That's also going to have two hundred and fifty dollars cash in it. So, the winner of that is. Let me grab my phone. So, the winner of the giveaway is Rosa underscore Gracia twenty one. So, we're gonna flash it up on the screen so that you can see who it is. We're also gonna leave it in the description box below. So, congratulations to you. You are the winner of the giveaway box full of makeup products and two hundred and fifty dollars cash. So, hopefully, that'll help you for Christmas. So, anyways, guys, just get out there, live your life, try to follow the rules, try to abide by everything, but live your life, guys, you know, for them to tell us to stay away from our families and everything else, that's just, I'm sorry, throw eggs at me, hate me, I don't know, but I'm, I'm not willing to just stay away from my loved ones, especially when we're all healthy and we're all fine, so anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video, um, I love making videos for you guys, uh, Fab is going to be back this week. So hopefully he'll be in my video with me on Friday. So until next time, stay safe. Find me everywhere on social media. I'm everywhere. And until next time, bye-bye.